Hey coach, what's up? If you're watching this video, I'm assuming you are a basketball trainer and you wanna learn how to start your basketball training business from scratch. And I'm gonna dive into the nitty gritty details here. So it might be good if you have a pen and a piece of paper. And if you have any questions, comment below this video so I can help you one-on-one -on -one there, all right? Now, if you are brand new, you haven't started training any players, this video is for you. And again, it's very important that you do this piece by piece. And let's say right now you are a high school basketball coach and you wanna branch off and do your own thing. And if that's you, what we have to focus on first is customers. We have to focus on getting customers. And this is where a lot of basketball coaches get this backwards. They want to try to create this big brand. They wanna have a crazy website. They wanna have all this gear and these t-shirts and these logos. And they're spending thousands of dollars before they ever get clients. The way I teach coaches how to build a real profitable, successful business is to get customers first. And that's what you have to focus on. And when you focus on that, then you have immediate revenue that can pay for a website, it can pay for t-shirts and all that stuff. And the first thing that you have to focus on is getting your very first customer though. And I've seen a lot of coaches struggle just getting their first customer and then they quit and they quit before they get traction. And it might take you a couple weeks or a month or maybe two months to get your first customer. But the way you get your first customer is by marketing. And again, like if you go back and watch the first couple of videos I ever have here on this channel, you hear me talk about all the time why that was hard for me. And I was shy, I was introverted, I hated talking to parents over the phone, and I didn't know how to market myself. And once I broke out of my shell, once I learned how to write emails, once I learned how to create videos, once I learned how to truly market my, my brand, that's when I started to get way more clients. And it's gonna be the same for you. And whether you like marketing or not, it's all about focusing on sales at the beginning, okay? And once you get your first customer, you'll have the self-belief that you can get as many customers as you want. But it's all about getting the first one and only focusing on that. Okay, so we've talked about getting the first customer, marketing, and what we have to do now is figure out your offer. So what is included in your program? Are you just showing up to the basketball court and putting on a one hour session and then that's it? If so, like welcome to the 99% club of all the basketball coaches in the US who do that. You don't wanna do that, all right? You need to be the opposite of what everyone else is doing. You need to add way more value to these kids. And by just showing up to the session, delivering a great session, that's not good enough anymore, right? Kids are not gonna stay in your program even if you're just a good trainer. That doesn't mean anything more. You need to become the mentor to these kids. And the way you do that is by offering value outside of the session. So how are you keeping these kids accountable? What are they doing when they're not training with you? Like, what's their level of respect for you when they're not training with you? Like, are they talking to you on a daily basis? Are they doing homework? Like, are you going to watch them play in their games? What is happening off the court? That's what I'm interested in. And once you figure that out, right, you will be able to have a system in place. And this system will allow you to get clients month after month after month. And they're going to stay in your program for years. I'm not talking about they're buying blocks of sessions. That bull crap doesn't work. And if you're watching this video and you've experienced that already, you know what I'm talking about. You have to be able to run this in a way where parents are paying you monthly or they're paying you annually to be a part of your program and they're committed. You're not working with uncommitted clients at that point. I'm gonna leave you on this note too. I want you to run your business the exact same way a gym membership would, okay? Let's say you're a member at a gym right now. You're not gonna go to the gym pay them and then say, hey, I'm gonna pay you next week to come use your gym again. That never happens. You give them your credit card and they take your credit card, they're gonna charge you every 30 days and you're not going to be able to pause your payment or stop your payment unless there's like a 60 day or 30 day cancellation. And this is how you want to run your business. And you do that by having contracts. If you don't have a contract, I highly recommend clicking this button here. I show you my contract, it's very in-depth, and that contract that I show you is responsible for coaches that I help that are closing clients that 
invest between like $5,000 to $10,000 per year in their program. So if you click on that button there, that'll take you to a page where you'll be able to access that contract. That's it for today's video. If you have any questions for me, comment below, hit that subscribe button if you're new. I'll see you next time.